question? Well, when I first started, um, I think uh, all those years ago, my, my um, parents, uh, mother used to ride for pleasure. My father was in the veterinary corps in the, in the army. And um, we lived at those, at that time, we we had fields behind where we lived, the house. And um, and I like being outside. I like I liked the horses. And so they bought me a pony. Um, he was called Oxo, and I learned to ride on him. Um, and I kept him until he died when he was 40. I think, you know, I've had some very good horses along the way, you know, with Apollo, St. James, Dollar Girl, Tinker's Boy, uh, Top Gun, um, Carlo. I don't think I've had one as good as this one. I mean, he's, he's super talented and he has, has a huge heart and he's mentality is very good and he's got everything you need in a in a horse. I think to win in Rio was probably the ultimate in I think in any sportsman's life um, to win the Olympic Games is 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 it um, and I think spe it's very special to me as you know I've been going for so many years and had so many near misses and accidents and didn't ride for two years and big star was off for two years you know, to come back and do that was very, you know, very special. That was the one thing that I had never achieved. Um, and I think, you know, I've had so many, like, letters and messages from the elder generation that have said what an inspiration it was to watch, that they've actually now motivated themselves to get up and go and do stuff that they never did before. Yeah, I mean, in 2000, when, that was when... Um, Sydney was Sydney Games that year. I was watching it from the hospital. I broke my neck and um, had this cage on for four months and a hard collar for another two months. I mean, it was a long, long road. And um, you know, I, I got told then that I, they didn't think I'd ride again. It was too dangerous, and that really was a, put the dampness on it. And then I didn't really know what to do. Um, you know, then I had Arco came along and I had him as a young horse and I always thought that was that was going to be the horse. So, you know, I sort of aimed, I thought, no, that can't, that can't be right. And I went everywhere to get to so many surgeons to get a, an opinion. And then I fin finally found um, um, a surgeon in, in Germany that thought that it would come right if you give it enough time. So that was the that was the only thing I wanted to hear. So I thought that's good. All right.